L'shana Tova. My name is Daniel Staffenberg, the CEO of the Jewish Community Federation of Richmond. On behalf of our Federation President, Ellen Renee Adams, our board, and entire professional team, we wish you a meaningful, healthy, and safe new year. Over the course of the next few days and weeks, we're excited to share direct to your inbox inspirational thoughts and messages from our community rabbis and a special message from our partners in Israel. Federation has also compiled and developed a one-stop high holiday resource guide on jewishrichmond.org to ensure that everyone in Greater Richmond has the opportunity to feel the warmth and strength of our community during the holidays. We are blessed here in Richmond with dynamic synagogues, each welcoming anyone to worship and join their communities. I encourage you to take advantage, explore each of them, and most importantly, get engaged. Whether you're doing it by Zoom or safely in person, I know you will find a community with outstretched arms ready to welcome you. I would have never predicted that yet again we'll be welcoming the new year, dipping our apples in honey, and celebrating these holidays concerned about COVID. I know how much pain and anxiety the last period has caused. I suspect that most of us have shed tears during this time, whether about our collective pain, troubling political discourse, isolation from our loved ones and community, or something more personal. We shed tears of grief, loss, anger, and despair. I pray, however, that you found the opportunity to shed tears of joy and strength from laughing with friends, finding community in new and refreshing ways, reconnecting with friends and spending more times with our precious families. Or like so many of you, you found our Richmond community to be generous, caring, understanding and uplifting. And that knowing this year, you felt the warmth and comfort and joy these much needed values provided during these times. Sometimes the tears surprise us when they come and are cleansing when they dry up. No matter how or why they come, they are physical signs of an open heart, a heart that is experiencing the world emotionally and contains deep feelings within it. They are signs of robust and fulfilled life. Tears, of our emotive, tears are a motive that weaves together our teachings on Rosh Hashanah. They teach us that these yamim noraim, these high holidays, are a time for opening our hearts and cultivating the ability and strength we have within us as individuals, as a community, and as a Jewish people. The work of this season, the work of Teshuvah, is the work of staying open-hearted and cultivating empathy for ourselves and others. It's the work of recognizing that community and family go hand in hand. Over the past year, our community has responded with generosity and care, helping so many who are struggling because we truly are one big family. As we begin a new year, fresh with opportunity and strength, I thank you for the key role you play in making our community so special. I thank you for supporting our Jewish Community Federation with generosity and most especially for recognizing that we are all in this together. Gamar Khatima Tova, may you be sealed for a good life this Yom Kippur.